Hey guys, I'm in the 2024. It's not 2024 yet. <laughs> This is the 2024 Chevy Trax. Really so blessed, so thankful, so excited! In a big body! Hello, beautiful people. Long time no talk, but today is, I think, December 21st, and I'm at the car dealership because I'm getting a car! I'm super, super excited. I'm here with my mom at uh, Don Brown Chevrolet in St. Louis. And yeah, I'm gonna take you guys through the day, through the process. Everything might not happen today, but at least we're starting, so yeah. Okay, so now we're about to go on the test drive. <laughs> and yeah, I, I won't show too much, I won't show too much, but uh, yeah. Okay, oh. Okay, so now we're in the car and we're about to do the test drive, so. Boom. See, Bo? <laughs> new car smell. I know, Ooh. it does smell like a new car. <laughs> All right, let's go. Why would they put that yellow pole right? Oh, okay. You like the way it feels? Yeah. It's new. I'm like, wow. 20 miles. It has 20 miles on it. So, that, wait, what? It's brand new, like brand spanking new. That's crazy. Only, Where oh, do we go? No, just somebody, yeah, the only thing is, it's been is test driven. By me. It's like really smooth. You want to try? Mm -mm. Oh, I can tell. <laughs> You're testing how it drives. I'm testing how, 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 I how the ride is. Oh, it smells like a new car. You said it has good gas mileage. Yeah, we said twenty-six dollars for a full tank. <laughs> it's like that's how much I paid to fill half of your tank. <laughs> Every two days. <laughs> Hold on, let me fix my seat real quick. Let's take Hampton Avenue, Turn here. 44 East St. Louis. Um, Turn right on Watson yeah. Road. And then turn again. Mm -hmm. The mirror is kind of funny. I think it's just the back oh, of the you shape. Know what? If you keep straight, it'll take you to the highway. The shape of the you back window. The Use the right lane to turn right to I-44 East. Because either way you can get off on King's Avenue. This is a song that you play to CPR. Like, you follow the breath. You follow oh, the... really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Staying alive. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Makes sense. <laughs> hey guys, I'm in the 2024. It's not 2024 yet. <laughs> Does it feel smooth as a passenger? Mm -hmm. Just trying to see how the bumps feel. Like it. Yeah, because in Jackson. <laughs> you got to remember when you get into North Jackson, that one place in North Jackson, ooh, you got to be ooh, careful. Fly. It'll take you here. Okay, so now we're about to hit the highway and see. So you're not on the highway long, uh -huh. so go ahead and get up to speed so you can see how it feels. Okay. Back. 
You like? I like it. That was nice. Okay, I just finished the test drive. I'm just te checking out the car. This is the 2024 Chevy Trax. Um, yeah, not gonna show too much because if I do get this one, I'm gonna do a car tour. So yeah, can't see everything. Bye. We're excited, huh? <laughs> yeah. Pen to paper. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I will get everything structured Merry up for Christmas, you. Merry Christmas, Maya. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Merry Christmas, Maya. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, so we just finished all the paperwork and stuff, and now we're going to go run some errands while we let them work for a few hours until we come back. Okay, ah! okay, I figured I would turn this into like a vlog, but I'm still waiting on the car. And I'm at my brother's school because he has to do like a choir audition or something. So I'm just gonna take you guys along with me to do that. And yeah. Okay, y'all, so I just got the call that the car is ready and everything is all good to go. So I'm about to get in my mom's car ah, and go head back to the dealership, do whatever else needs to be done, and then show y'all the car and then drive away. I'm literally so excited. Oh my gosh, I thought this day would um never come. So I'm really glad that it's here. So we're back at the dealership. It's really loud, so hopefully y'all can hear me, but we're back at the dealership. I got Mason with me this time so he can get his own kind of review of the car um i don't see it out here yet which means that it's still you know being worked on or whatever but it's mine and i'm super excited hopefully i don't get copyrighted but i do hear christmas music so i'm gonna go ahead and stop here but maybe the next clip that you'll see will be my car or my reaction to the car so stay tuned oh it is Woo! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Ah! Yeah, they put the boat. Mason, what do you think? It's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> pretty good, that's all you have to say. No, I'm sitting here. Ah! There's literally a boat on it. Ah! Hello, what do you have to say? What do I have to say? Yeah. Well, I have to say, I'm so glad that my baby is getting her vehicle. Period. You deserve it, kid. You deserve it. Period. Ah! Ah! Come on, come on. Make some noise. Come on. Bro, I'm so lit. Oh, the boat is on here. Okay. I'm so lit. Mm. It literally has a new car smell. 28 miles. Eight, eight miles were from my test drive. 20 miles is how many it came with. So it's literally brand new. Mm. So spacious. Ah! I'm so excited. <sighs> shout out to my mom. Shout out to my dad. Shout out to my brother. Shout out to the gang. No, I'm just fine. But um, yeah, I don't really know what to say right now. So I'm just going to take this in and then uh, see you guys later. Okay. <laughs> a zoom meeting in here. Um, but yes. 
You stoked? Mm hmm. All right. Any other questions? Are you guys going back there? We're good. <laughs> you good? No, no other questions. All right. This is so crazy. We just called and set up the OnStar and everything, set up my Apple CarPlay. Mason is riding with me for our first real drive i don't know where we're gonna go probably get some food or something but i'm literally so blessed so thankful so excited in a big body but no for real um 28 miles i already showed everything i'm gonna do a little tour show the outside of everything i'm so geeked first car and it's a 2024 it's 2023 it's december 21st 2023 and um i have a 2024 chevy Trax. I'm so lit. I'm, I literally cannot even process this right now. But when I do, I don't know. Okay, I don't have anything else to say that I'm just excited besides the fact that I'm excited. Mason, what do you have to say? It's the big back mobile. Okay. <laughs> and that's where we say bye. <laughs> day two of having my car it hasn't been 24 hours yet maybe like 22 ish but it's a really rainy day in st louis a rainy friday so i decided to take today and go shop for um some stuff that i want for my car first i decided to start with like the arm rest thing and then create like a little kit or whatever in the trunk so i'm going to start with the arm rest show y'all what i got and then place everything in there First, I got this magnetic car vent phone holder for my phone. It's just to put in my air vent so I'm safe on the roads. I got tissue, gum, hand sanitizer, some feminine products, deodorant, a first aid kit, Vaseline, and some pins, and that is it. That's gonna go in here. And then um, after I put the stuff in here, I'll show what I got for the trunk. So hold on one second. Everything is pretty much in there. The only things that I haven't gotten that I probably will pick up are like lotion and then um, just some stuff that I think about like while I'm in the store and I'm like, oh, I need this. So that's pretty much done. And now we can move on to the thing for the trunk. So I started off at Target and got this felt basket. It's a pretty good size. I was kind of going to go bigger, but then once I started getting the stuff, I realized that this was a good size. So I got this felt basket from Target that matches pretty much my interior. I got this super cute throw blanket from Target. Um, it has hearts on it and it's pink. It's pretty much for Valentine's Day, but I just thought it was cute. So I got it anyways. I got some car cleaning wipes, um, an umbrella, Clorox wipes the leftover stuff from the arm rest including the tissues and oh and i got this mini vacuum it's called the turtle wax and i just thought it was super cute it wasn't too expensive it was literally like ten dollars and it's just a mini vacuum so it cleans up like crumbs in the seat stuff on the floor um, it's made for cars and like tiny rooms and desks and offices and stuff So I think this is gonna work really really well I'm super excited about this because even though it's been less than 24 hours. There are already like leaves and stuff on my floor and No crumbs in the seat because we're not doing eating in here right now. No, but there's there's leaves and stuff on the floor So I'm excited to get these get that up um, And I'm gonna keep like I said all of this stuff in the trunk and i'll just kind of add to it just like the armrest as i see fit like whatever's necessary so hopefully it dries up tomorrow and gets a lot sunnier because i really want to do like a full car overview um with everything i ordered some stuff from amazon that's not here yet but it's really not too much just like a lanyard a keychain holder a wristlet 
Mm, just some very basic stuff that's like actually a necessity. So once that stuff comes in, um, I might update it, I might not. Cause like I said, it's really not anything that changes the interior or the exterior, but um, it's just stuff that I like. So tomorrow, day three, you'll see the car. Hey y'all, it's day three of owning a car and I'm at the car wash about to vacuum out my floor because there's already like leaves and stuff on the floor and I'm not, I'm not going. Like my brother, we already got into a whole argument about eating in the car and everything. And somehow there's like stuff on the floor and leaves and stuff and I'm just not really feeling it. So I'm here to vacuum out the car for the first time. Um, even though they literally just vacuumed it when I got it, but here we are I'm about to get it done and it's not raining today so i can actually show you guys my car but yeah let's get to vacuuming and then we're going to find somewhere to park so i can show you die when I was at the car wash but everything is all clean now and I wanted to show you guys my car this is the 2024 Chevy Trax in the color crimson let me block out my license plate mm-hmm isn't she cute this is the outside it's a in between a compact car and um, a truck don't mind the suitcase but um yeah let's get into the inside i don't know what i'm gonna name my car yet but this is the inside i'm gonna turn off the music so i don't get copyrighted this is the inside um let's head to the back seat there's a ton of space back here way more space than a compact car but not like as much space as like the jeep i'm used to driving um, my mom's Jeep, but it seriously does have a ton of space. I love the color. I love everything about it. Now let's get into the trunk. So this is the trunk. Here is that kit that I made yesterday. I just put this here for right now because I needed to clean it out. But yeah, this is the trunk. This is the view from back here. Super spacious, two rows. There's a spare tire back here. And it just has a lot of trunk room. I have my suitcase in here because I needed to do something with it. But it fits like easily in there with a whole bunch of room left. I really, really, really love this car. I love the seats a lot. Um, this is the One RS model. And before, when I saw it the first day, I went home and literally went on YouTube to look up everything about it. And then the next day when I went back to buy it, I knew everything I was looking for. So it has a digital display up here, um, CarPlay obviously, um, and Android Play or something like that. But yeah, this is everything up here. The armrest that I did yesterday with all of my stuff. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't know what I'm gonna name my car. I'm thinking Ruby, but I don't know. It's up in the air. We're, me and my friends are having like a debate or kind of like a survey as far as what I should name it. So I'm gonna give it like another week or so. Just let everything settle in. It still has very fresh new car smell and I'm trying to hold on to that for as long as I can. Um, oh, also, I really love these blue accents because I feel like since it's a crimson car or a red car, I feel like you would think that the accents and stuff inside are red, but these ones are actually blue. And I think that's because it's the sport model or it's not the active model, but I think it's the sport model, um, which is why it has the blue accents. I really love this car. Like I said, it's a 2024. So it's very technologically savvy and everything. Everything is very up to date. Okay, I feel like I'm just rambling at this point, so I'm gonna close out the video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, like, comment, and subscribe, whatever they say. And stay tuned for a whole lot more car content. I feel like when I watch YouTube, I love to see people like doing their day in the lives, day to day stuff, um, and like having their camera on the dashboard. So I'm gonna do a whole lot of that because that's the stuff I like to see. So it's the stuff that I'm gonna like to create. And yeah, 
Let me know if you guys like my car. I got a car. I got a car. 